on a Friday. I'm Dale Hoffman. Good evening. I'm Diana Raphael. Up top tonight, a jury has returned a unanimous death sentence for the Kashat. Condolences are being given to the family today for Jimmy Chevalier. The 59-year-old Chevalier passed away last night in Rapids Regional Medical Center. News Channel 5's Lee Culbert spoke with one of Chevalier's longtime friends and co-worker who says Chevalier will be missed. The death of 59-year-old Alexandria City Marshal candidate Jimmy Chevalier came as a complete surprise to those who knew him, like Rapids Parish Sheriff's Office Assistant Chief Herman Walters. When I got the call yesterday that he was in very serious condition, it, it really, it, 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 it shocked me that he was that sick. Uh, and then I got word later that he had passed on. And it's always hard to hear a good friend like that when uh, you get the word that, that something has happened to him. There's no word yet on Chevalier's exact cause of death, but Chief Walter says he suspects it had something to do with complications of cancer that Chevalier was diagnosed with years ago. He didn't talk much about it. He was kind of quiet, but we all knew that Jimmy was, was sick. We didn't, I don't think we realized he was sick as he was. Walter says he and Chevalier grew close as they worked side by side for many years at the Alexandria Police Department and then again at RPSO. He says Chevalier always talked about wanting to run for office. He had set a goal uh, years ago to run for city marshal. That, that was what he really, he had picked out to be his, his, his choice. And as time went on, Jimmy did indeed uh, retire from us, from the sheriff's office. And he qualified. So I've been on the fringes of it uh, throughout my entire police career, but I'm excited about the opportunity to serve the people. If you serve the public and do a good job of it, um, I feel that they'll reward you. Walter says Chevalier always gave 100% to anything he put his mind to. He says he had a witty personality and a positive attitude like no other. Everybody leaves a, a legacy behind and and the same for Jimmy. We can always look back and remember the, the times we had together. Jimmy was a, was a people kind of a guy, and uh, he will be missed, and he uh, really will. Reporting in Alexandria, Lee Colbert, News Channel 5. Visitation will be Sunday from 5 until 9 at Hickson Brothers in Alexandria, then again Monday from 10 until 2 at Calvary Baptist Church on Jackson Street. The funeral will follow right after that. Chevalier will be buried at the Alexandria Memorial Gardens. He is survived by his wife, Elizabeth, and five children.